what's happening guys Koopo here it's time for another video we're gonna do the quest called there is always something to do so let's go ahead and get started so first thing we need to do is we need to go talk to Ragnar I have not spoken to him yet at all so he's still up on the stairs here for you he might be up top uh, don't worry if you can't find him at the end of the video if you just skip ahead I have to talk to him again and he'll be up there and so you'll you'll find him either way through my video. So we're gonna talk to him. Dog, what is your crime? You just can't tell him that you're an owl. I am Warlord Ragnar, patron of this berserker settlement. While Master Thorold Apparently, you can't do this quest Anyone if you tell him that you're an owl. So. so there's a lot of talking. Like, see this? I am an owl defector. I can't say that. I can't do the quest. So I'm just gonna click through this real fast. So so you had better think very it's like 10 minutes of dialogue if I don't just skip through so we're just gonna skip through looking forward you can so if you eat if you not yes eat sir um let's assume I'll see that yeah what kind of because yeah food Special job. If I that's a lot. You know, plus the so him. We don't. Uh, let's see. About my support. And then, is you have to ask? Is there anything else I can do for you right here? So pretty much just talk to him. Don't tell him you're an owl defector. And, and then you can get him here to this point where you can say, is there anything else I can do for you? Is there anything else that I can do for you? You see, since there... Oh, and... You should give me the quest. There it is. There is always something to do. So we got the quest now. So you can ask him what the world heart is if you want, but I'm going to show you. Uh, and it won't let you out of the menu unless you ask him about the armor. Where can I buy armor? Where can I buy... You... Why not? So. Now I can end the chat. Now he's gonna walk back up to where he should be. Okay, so. You better get rid of that technology. Okay, okay. So you, what you can do is you can go in here and you can set a checkpoint. There's always something to do. Mark on map. So. Right down here. This is where we need to go. So we're gonna go down here, that's where the, uh, what do they call it, World Heart or something like that? So we're gonna go down, we're gonna talk to him. Let's see, what's the best way out of here? There's gonna be a lot of bad guys and we're just gonna have to kind of skip through them as best we can. Let's see. I'm going to the right dot, the yellow dot, right? Yeah, it's like south. Okay, so I'm just gonna fly off. Oh, jetpack. <laughs> Alright. So we gotta be a little careful as we run through. Whoa. Also a teleporter up here that you're gonna want to get and I'll also show you where that is it's gonna be quick though there's there's a lot of bad guys so when you get the teleporter it's just like you kind of run over it and you run away okay where am I let's look at the map real quick teleporters like right here so let's get to that teleporter. Try not to aggro. Yeah, that's a ruin, all right. There's probably some good loot in here too, but okay. 
So kind of down and to the right. It's like right in front of me somewhere here. Whoa, there's like a... Must not be as far as I think I am. Okay, there's... Wait a minute, where's the... I'm trying to find the teleporter for you guys. It's right here. It's to the east, so it'd be over this way. Where are you, teleporter? Teleporter... There it is. See it right there? So, let me look at my map. It's... It's like right in front of me right here. So you're gonna wanna grab this teleporter. So let's go grab it real quick. Step on it and then run away. All right, we got it. Okay, now we can go talk to this guy. Oh, looks like we got aggro on something back there. Is it chasing us? Yeah, it is. Save me. Yeah, they killed it. It's still pretty weak right now. I don't know if I can deal with that stuff. All right, so here's Erdor. Ooh. Who are you? What are you doing here? You seem I'm no threat. I'm no. <laughs> what? So we just but talk to him until he gives you the quest. What is, what, what, how long? I, I always just try to click the less rude one. Now I can take. Well, at least when I do the quick videos. House? You mean that? Anything you? Yeah, but if you're, I'm not. Can you? Why? Where do you direct? I will. Okay, we got the quest. Might as well click Ours. these. Yeah. What do you? So he wants me to get fifty loafs. So. You can search for them, but apparently that takes forever. So let's go back to Goliet. Just fast teleport back. And that's why I wanted you to grab that teleporter over there, because once we get the loaves, we're going to have to teleport back. Wait, wait. One moment. What now? Seeing as you're looking to send... Oh, okay. So, and... Uh... Okay, this is opening another quest. But we're not doing that one right now. We'll do that later. We're gonna talk to... Cinda. Your door needs supplies. Your door? Yeah, but... I promise... I'm not... Okay. So, what if I? You ever? I mean, for all right. So we have a, a decision to make here. I'm just gonna talk about this real quick. There's two ways you can do this quest. You can talk about her moldy bread that she throws out, and you can actually go grab the moldy bread from outside of her house, and you can then go give that moldy bread to the guy instead of giving him good bread that you buy with your money. And I don't know what's bad about it. Uh, I read an article that said that they just, uh, everyone's just not as happy and a bunch of people get sick. So I don't know if it's an RP thing uh, or how important it is. Probably, probably pretty important for getting like an ending maybe i'm not sure but anyway you have two options you can do the moldy bread route or i can trade 
can we trade? Look around. And she has, see, she has loaves. So I'm just going to do this way because I like to make everybody happy. I don't want to give them bad bread, even though it's cheaper. So we're going to buy them. They're five each. So there's 18. And all you have to do is talk to her again. Can we trade? Look around. Tell me what you need. And then get the love up here. Set the trade. Then we'll talk to her again. Can we trade? Look around. Tell me what you need. Cultivator slope, and that's gonna put us at 50. And that's that's how many we need for the quest is 50 of the loaf. All right, so we got 50. So we're gonna do that route. Um, if you wanted to do the moldy bread, it's I, I didn't talk to her about it because I'm not doing it. But there's supposed to be like something out here, some sort of trash where she just throws it out. Take a quick look for you guys. There it is. So, right back here. If you come back here, right there, there's the moldy bread. You could take the moldy bread if you wanted to, and then that would also finish the quest. So, it is up to you. Alright, now let's go turn this in. Okay, we're back to the river delta. Uh, I can get and turn around. Where's the heart? Oh, there it is. Looks like we might be getting chased here. Oh, there's spit. Kill that mage! So, yeah, I'm just running away. Let them deal with it. Some extra loot. Alright, so let's see. I gotta talk to this guy. Alright, I got his supplies. I brought supplies. You have? Oh, I'm salivating already. I have brought you the cultivator's loaf. You are a born gatherer. Alright, and then that's complete. Now we just gotta go talk to Regar. You can, you can just teleport up here to the hotel ruins. If you have this teleport. So for those of you who don't know who Ragar is, at the start I told you I'd show you where he is. He's all the way at the top. And he's in here. After I turn this in, I'll run back down just so you can see the pathway and then, then I'll end the video. So here we go. It's Ragar on his throne. About my support, about I think. My support. I took care of Erdor. I took care of your door. Are there any problems? None to speak of. You have proved yourself a friend to the Berserkers, Zizak. The work Erdor does is at the heart, the world heart, of everything we stand for. It's criminal that we hadn't helped him before. Thank you. All right. Is he going to let me out of here or do I have to talk more? <laughs> what? It doesn't let me out of the dialogue sometimes unless I... Why? Uh, what? It, at the end, it, do you know that? Spoken. Uh, you. How do I get out of this dialogue? Oh, you can just scroll down. I'm probably... <laughs> Did I just figure that out? I am silly. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna run back down the path to show you guys 
how I got here. And, uh, yeah. Hopefully this is helpful to you guys. Go ahead and, uh, hit that like button, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Alright, so here... This is where, uh, Duras is. What's this guy's name? Cormag, I think. Cormag's right here. I'm just, I'm just doing this just in case some of you guys don't know how to get to him. So, so we're just following the path down. Uh, th over there, I'll head over to Angrim, and then if you keep going over here, you'll, you're about to know where we are. Come just keep me. following the path. And then we're back here. This is where uh, this is where we talked to him the first time at the very start of the video, right here. Right, so this should look familiar from the start of the video. And then back here is uh, Cinda's hut, or Cinda's house, or whatever you want to call it, is right here. And there's Cinda. All right, so now you know how to find him. And that's it. All right, thanks, guys. You guys have a good rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next video.